so now we will uh, register the user and then we will refresh uh, the page and we'll see that user is still registered so while doing that uh, when i am loading my page when there is no token in the application when there is nothing stored no token is there then my application is crashing right now so you can see application is crashing and then it is saying an error if you refresh keep going then you'll see the error that that subscribe of undefined and if i debug this properly then i find that it goes to here it is getting the token find me if you go to the app component we are asking this dot auth service dot find me it should return the object if token is there otherwise it should just uh, redirect into the saying that you have not logged in you have to go to login page kind of but right now it is not doing that it is just throwing exception in the find me saying that undefined it is returning undefined and and undefined cannot have subscribe function that's the error we are getting and if you debug it it goes to the find me function and here we are getting the token and it token is the null and if token is null i'm just returning return if i am not returning anything by default what goes it goes the undefined because there is nothing we are returning so by default it, it is returning undefined and it goes to back to app component and here it exception comes that uh, on undefined if i am trying to access the subscribe function then it will say that cannot read the property subscribe on undefined this is the message you will get of undefined clear so in order to fix this uh, in rxjs there is a uh, there is a inbuilt uh, uh, observable that you can return which is basically empty empty means it will not throw exception but it will not do the next on the on the subscribers so so let's fix that first what i'll do is i'll go in the find me function instead of returning just return i'll say return empty and i'll import it from the rxjs so this empty will take care and since i'm running my application in uh, uh, in a watch mode it will just compile it auth service does error cannot find empty so let's see from where it is pulling this empty so empty should come from rxjs let me just to restart so i created a new uh, script called as serve client uh, which is in the package json this is the new script i added serve client is um, is basically it was initially start i renamed it to serve client because start we will keep it uh, for our different purpose so we'll create a start script as a separate script later on but for now serve client will make sense it will just say that it will create a it will compile the code and create the new new uh, code base in a debug mode so now you see uh, it is working so now i can go to the products page and home page and login page right so at this time if i'm refreshing it will not crash because it is returning empty and then app component is not crashing it basically so this is good so let's do that fix that we were discussing that once you register let's say if i put some name here and then if i register then after registering it is showing the name nitya over here right however f12 let me keep 12 f12 however if i refresh then i am not seeing the name here that's the problem so let's see the problem first now if i refresh i don't see the name here although i am logged in yet now it is server is identifying me however i am not getting the name here properly and the reason behind that is uh, let's debug what's the reason right so if i refresh and go to the auth service so first you have to subscribe uh, this is find me you'll call find me and this will go to the auth service and here we are not uh, getting the user we are getting user and token both and where is this mistake basically so if you go to the auth service so in this find me just see that in this find me when you go to the server and get the response on find me you remember we were not returning just the user we were returning user and token both right now the mistake is i'm i'm getting user and token which is i am assuming i am only getting user and putting it into the uh, uh, subject of the user this dot set user is what it is just sending the users dot next which is subscribed here as a this dot user dot subscribe and you are getting instead of getting user you are getting user plus token both are you getting it are you following me so basically in the find me if i debug it now uh, let me debug to show you if i refresh hit f5 so see uh, in at this time server is able to find you but it is not giving just user it is giving you both thing it is giving user and token 
so from here we have to just extract the user part and set it in the user subject so that whoever has subscribed to the user subject they will get the user rather than the uh, user and token so the fix is let's go to the auth service and here uh, when you when we say find me i have any here right and it returns find me and this is returning two things so in order to get individual property from the uh, ob object i'll use this destructor and i'll say i want user and token both you can take for now we'll just take the user and just push it into the set user function and this time it should set the user properly into the user subject and then you'll get it into the uh, menu so let me refresh this page so now you see nitya right so we made this correction if we go f12 source refresh so in find me now i'm just extracting the user part of it i was getting both user and token but i just i'm just extracting user part of it and setting that user to here the moment you do set it will call the subscribe uh, when you do the set it will call the subscribe of here automatically subscribe will be called right you know that part right whenever we subject dot next it will just call it here and you'll get the user object properly here with the name full name nitya and then email id or all of the information and it should just work so this is good so we uh, successfully we could register a user and we could identify that same user when you refresh so this is one use case that we wanted to achieve so next use case is when you are going to log out somehow it is not logging out that's the problem right so that we will fix that issue next is when you log out it should log out properly so if i go ahead and nitya and say log out and if you refresh you again get get the nitya back and the problem is we'll see next what exactly going on 